Hi, Dr. Bull. I see that you are also shopping for meat. Yes, we usually eat beef, but I feel like eating pork today. I know you are an expert in meat. Maybe you can give me some advice on choosing fresh meat. Sure. What kind of meat are you having for dinner today? The meat here is all very fresh and delicious. Especially meat from the USA, since it's quality assured. What do you mean by quality assured? Well, you see, all meat from the USA has HACCP approval. Uh, HACCP? What's that? <laughs> HACCP is the standard originally created for Cosmo food production developed by NASA. It's quite important, especially in regard to the meat and food industries. It guarantees the safety of food. Wow! I am surprised that there is so much knowledge involved in producing a box of meat. Dr. Bull, I'm all ears. Okay. I'll first tell you about HACCP. HACCP represents a highly hygienic management system developed in the United States. It stands for Hazard Analysis and Critical Control Point. In other words, it's a hygienic management system for producing food. HACCP assures the consumer that food safety won't be jeopardized by anyone or any conditions during food production. Huh, okay, I get it. In that case, what are the features? Here are the five main features of HACCP. One, it oversees all hazardous points and centralizes operations. Two, it offers an integrated certification system for the food industry. Three, it also strengthens the scientific administration and supervision of food production. Four, it lets us quickly confirm and handle any accidents. Five, and it constantly works to upgrade and update management rules and regulations to cover every possible condition. But how does HACCP work? Actually, HACCP doesn't have one standard procedure or set of hazardous points for all products. It depends on the product itself, the production method, and the work environment. First, let's look at U.S. meat to see how HACCP works. Holding area. 1. The U.S. Food Safety and Inspection Service officers examine all livestock. 2. Clean, dry, and scale. Slaughter. Phase 1. 1. Clean and sterilize all facilities and equipment before slaughter. 2. Clean and sterilize hands and all cutting tools after every slaughter. 3. Inspect internal organs, brain, and lymph nodes from every carcass. Slaughter, phase two. One, clean carcasses with hot water. Two, sterilize carcasses with organic acid. Chilling. One, Freeze carcasses at extremely low temperatures to prevent the growth of microorganisms. 2. Inspection for microorganisms. Fabrication. Clean and sterilize all facilities and equipment before cutting. Packaging. 1. Keep product in a vacuum-packed state. 2. Maintain low temperature freezing of product from factory to retail outlet. Export. Maintain a minus 1.2 degrees Celsius temperature for the meat from factory to Taiwan. 
Wow! HACCP really does have high standards for food safety and quality. That's right. Did you know the U.S. Meat Export Federation has been devoted to promoting safe and high quality meat exports since 1976? The U.S. meat industry insists not only on the finest quality, but also on the highest levels of hygiene and safety. This is how we can have healthy and delicious U.S. meat. Then I can enjoy my meat as long as it's U.S. beef or pork. In that case, I'm definitely going to buy U.S. meat for my meal. You are very welcome to join my U.S. meat feast tonight. And many thanks for your explanation about HACCP. Sure, if you insist, I'd love to go. Hey, hey, it's it.